don't know who I am, I am Sharon, and I'm going to show you how to slice a tomato. Stay tuned. And we're back. Slicing a tomato is so easy, but first you need a couple of things. Number one, you need a good tomato, a nice, firm, ripened tomato that's red in color and firm on the outside. Next, you're going to need a knife. I recommend either a serrated knife or a slice knife, a knife to slice with. I prefer the knife to slice with, the straight edge. never want to start out cutting anything without sharpening your knife first. So make sure you sharpen your knife. Next, to cut it, you want to hold it firm to your cutting board. And you want to take your knife and slice right through the top of your tomato. And then again, right at the same point, you're going to pierce it down and slice all the way down. And then again, at the same angle, the same size, hopefully, <laughs> as you can see. I had a little hard time getting it all like worked out but for the most part they're all sliced At this point, you're done slicing your tomato. You can fan it out like I was doing, or you can make sure that each tomato slice is completely cut, and you can place them on your cutting board. I like getting a food storage container so that I can put it into the refrigerator and keep it for, you know, sandwiches and burgers and stuff later on. I specifically left out the top and the bottom, um, but I'm going to keep them just because I don't want to waste any of my tomato or anything. I can dice it and add it 
to something else later. You make sure the lid goes on. You want to make sure that there's no air. Lastly, I like to store my tomatoes that I cut up all nicely on the second shelf in my refrigerator. I hope this video was super helpful for you. If you find this helpful, make sure that you like, subscribe, and comment down at the bottom. Have the best day ever.